Greetings all, Fanny here for Virgo's Daily Oracle Message. Virgo, let me know if the new setup works for y'all. You guys can hear me better, you can see me better. I'm trying stuff out to make sure I can get you guys the best quality videos. While I'm figuring out everything else in my life, what is our message today? Beautiful. So Virgo, our first affirmation, and an affirmation is a prayer or mantra that you repeat yourself to work with the law of attraction to spell your dream reality into existence. Our affirmation is create, a gentle whisper here, a tug in your womb there. You sense it, you can sense it, can't you? When you lie awake at night wondering why you cannot sleep, your body knows what you're meant to be do, what you are here to do. The wisdom of your purpose is ingrained in your very cells. So when you hear the faint whisper pulling at your heart, when you feel the beckoning within your womb, stand strong and clear as day. When you cannot sleep, create. Beautiful. That is beautiful. Yes, and, and that, that tug in your heart, in your head, in your gut, that random thought that comes in your head, that is your intuition speaking to you. Your intuition comes from your solar plexus, solar plexus chakra. Apparently I've had too much coffee today. Your solar plexus chakra is the yellow one under the base of your breastbone that, intu that works with your intuition. It is the direct connection that we have to our higher self. The other card here is move. It is stagnant, my dear. This energy you carry, it feels stuck within you, just sitting there. Deep within, deep in your belly, resting upon your shoulders, etched across the lines of your face, like a rusty old gate. It simply will not move. But notice, my love, how easily the gate begins to work again, when oiled and painted anew, awoken from its dormant position, when it is simply moved again. You are no different, my dear. You simply need to move. Yes, if there has been stagnancy and things stuck in your life, you feel like you've been running around in the same situation, move in a different direction. And if you don't know what that direction is, this is the time to speak to your spirit team. Use your imagination to see what kind of dream reality you would bring about into existence if you could. Detox. We too often see this word and instantly think body diet, movement, but do we ever stop to think about how we can cleanse our minds? What mental clutter are we hanging on to, perhaps unnecessarily? Sister, if it does not spark joy in your mind, in your body, or in your soul, discard it. Just as we have the power to select the foods we eat, we have the power to select our thoughts. Detoxifying our mind, body, and soul begins with one select thought at a time. Yes, exactly. If you've been feeling stagnant and stuck in your own energy, it is time to detoxify your system and remove that which no longer serves you. And simply state this, Spirit, remove from me that which does not serve my greatest and highest good. The old toxic energy that clings to me, that which blocks my energy flow. I want it removed. And these are the words that you can say when doing your energy work in stretching, in healing, even showering. Close your eyes and imagine the water dripping over you as a golden or silver light, cleansing and releasing from you all the blackness and sludge that is toxifying your soul and your body. This is a form of Reiki. This is a form of energy manipulation and a very basic step for people starting upon the path of spirituality, manifestation, and light working. So Virgo, please understand you can be whole. You don't have to react the same way that you always did because you are not the person that you were before. You are ready to heal, my love. And Spirit is asking you to do so because you have something great to create. I love you, Virgo.